What's going on folks? This is a uh, special unboxing edition of Jonesified. Right now I'm doing this real quick. Uh, it's Friday morning. Just picked up The Order 1886 Collector's Edition. Now, I've heard a lot of flack about this game on the internet. And unfortunately, I'm hoping I don't get buyer's remorse. But the collector's just been 20 bucks more and you get a bunch of bonus stuff, so that's cool. Um, I'll do a video debating length of game and stuff like that in the near future. It'll probably be helpful. But let's go ahead and crack this baby open. Um, when they were doing PlayStation 3 stuff, they showed this game off and it looked impressive. It's made by um, Ready to Dawn Studios, who made some God of War games for the, I think, the PS... Vita, PSP. Um, played them, they're pretty fun. But, uh, I mean, like I said, some people say the game's really short and I'm kind of scared to play it, to be honest with you. Um, but, I already bought it, so let's unbox this bad boy. There it is. Pop this top open here. Alright, shouldn't be too much. So on top we've got Steelbook edition of the game. That's really cool. Let's see if there's anything on the inside. We've got the game case. <coughs> we've got digital content. The Knight's Arsenal DLC includes Red Knight Uniform and Black Knight Uniform with rifles. There's unreleased behind the scenes footage and an official game soundtrack. Now, game soundtrack thing is kind of disappointing to me. If you're going to pack a soundtrack, you should have it, you know, there. You should have a physical copy. I always feel like uh, downloading a digital copy of the soundtrack is kind of crappy. But that's just my opinion. Because I can't really do it. What am I going to do? Keep it on my PlayStation? Ooh, I can listen to it on my PlayStation. I can't listen to it anywhere else. So that's kind of silly. But that's the way things work these days. I got an advertise advertisement for Bloodborne, which is like Dark Souls. I saw a video of it. It looks insanely difficult. Got some cool stickers. Um, it's like there's the seals or of the characters in the game. Three of the characters. So first of all, Lady... I'm gonna say that wrong. Granny and Sir Galahad are main characters. That's pretty, pretty neat. Um, but, here's the game case. The meat of this special edition is underneath here. So that in now. So the reason I got it, oh my god, that is freaking cool as hell. That's awesome. So, let me get the bad boy out completely here. This is, oh yeah. Well, that's not cool. That's not cool. I guess you gotta place that. This is a statue of our main character, Sir Galahad. That's fucking awesome, actually. That's really cool. That very detailed statue. I'm gonna bring it in a little bit. Film and cover. He's looking pretty BA, because it's a pretty BA character. I guess this little fence thing goes up here. It's kind of silly. The fence right there. That's kind of the main reason. I mean, 20 extra bucks for basically this. <laughs> Which falls apart because that's not attached. That's really freaking cool. I'm very impressed with this statue. Um, but, as I said, though, uh, if you'd like to join the discussion, hit me up on the um, Twitters and Facebooks at uh, CaseyJones681 on Twitter, Clayman Jones Project page on Facebook. Talk to me a little bit about it, tell me what your impressions are, tell me if this is one of those games that's going to make you not pre-order stuff anymore. Because if it's disappointing, I'm probably not going to pre-order. The next game I will pre-order will be Batman Arkham Knight because I'm looking forward to that one and I really want that Batman statue as well. So I'll probably splurge a little bit and get that. But uh, yeah, um, I'll uh, review my impressions and stuff on my Facebook and Twitter if you want to check it out. Let me know what you think about the game if you've played it. If you're playing it in the comments below, tell me how you feel about uh, game length and whether or not this was worth the money. I'm hoping it is. I'm very optimistic. It's just how I roll. But thanks for watching Jonesified. Be sure to uh, stay tuned for more things very, very soon. Uh, I'll holler at you later. Deuces! Hey guys, thanks for checking out my channel. If you're interested in any other videos, go check out the rest. I've got a bunch of them if you're new here. Um, if you want to find me on social media, find me at CaseyJones681 on Twitter. 
and at the Calamity Jones Project page on Facebook. That's Calamity with a K. Check out our other folks. Check out my friend Calamity's videos on GameStop. Whole lot of content for you. Thanks for watching.